Hi, my name is Stephen McGee, and I'm the author of Solar Photovoltaic Design, Residential, Commercial, and Utility Systems. And we're here today to look into the cloud effect. And to do that, we have this jar of water, and on top of our jar of water, you'll see a circular film of oil that's riding on top of it. And this is for the cloud effect. So, in particular, the edge of cloud effect is what we're going to look at today. And there's nothing special about this oil, it's just ordinary vegetable oil. And we're going to see how light transmits through this film of oil that's on the, the surface. And to do that, we have this laser pointer. So it's just a standard laser pointer that you can buy in most shops. So let's look at the oil film and see what happens. Now the thing I want you to do is keep an eye on the laser at the bottom of the jar because we're going to move the laser and we're going to pass through the edge and we're going to see a jump. See a little jump that's taking place? That's the edge of cloud effect that occurs in nature. Now our alignment is vertical right now so I'm going to go off on an angle and we can see how that jump happens. So it's more noticeable when we're on an angle. I'm going to go a little bit steeper. So the edge of cloud effect is a magnification effect and it causes havoc in solar power systems because it can actually blow the fuses on the power plant. So you need to design your system to take into account this effect so that it's reliable. So I hope that this video helps you with designing solar power systems and that the awareness of this effect will enable you to design reliable solar power plants. I hope you enjoyed this presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.